Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. In uh, this particular tutorial, I'm going to take you through Zotero. Number one, how to install the Zotero into your PC and also how to link uh, your Zotero to your Word for the purpose of citation and referencing. Having done that, I will take you through on how to add, uh, to add and edit citation how to add and edit biography, and uh, lastly, how to add and edit a reference. So step number one, open on their site, which is uh, zotero.org. Then you download, uh, you're supposed to download uh, this one, Zotero 6 for Windows and uh, Zotero connectors. These and these alone. Having done that, install the, the Zotero onto your PC. After that, after installing, ensure that uh, you link you link your Zotero to your Word. I'd already shown you on how to link the two. If you look at my previous video, I've done on how to manually install Zotero to Word processor plugin if it's missing in your Word. Okay, I've already done that. As you can see, if you look at uh, if you look at uh, my word, you can see that uh, there is a Sotero here. On the menu bar, we have the file, home, insert, page, references, mailing, review, view, and lastly, the Zotero. So assuming that uh, this is the document that uh, you want to work on. Number one, let's start with the citation. So you'll click uh, the Sotero. So assuming that you want to insert your citation here at that point. So step number one, you have to to press the, the space bar to create a space. So you go to Zotero, then you pick uh, the citation style that uh, you want to use. For my case, I will go for the Rubians 9th edition, then I'll click OK. Okay, after that, there is a, this one will pop up, then uh, click the classic view. The drop down button will uh, lead to popping up of uh, the classic view. So you click that part. So there are so many. So let me go to my. So these are my books that I've already downloaded and uh, the references that I have. So let's assume that I want to use this one. So step number one, you click the book that you want to use, then you specify the page. Assuming that I want to cite page, so I will insert only the page. So you ignore the prefix because it's already here. So you ignore the, the prefix and the suffix. So just write down the, the page, then you click OK. So you'll find that uh, it will already appear here, basing on uh, the Turibian style. It's a very simple step, very easy. Okay, on the issues of uh, having done that, I can also add, uh, maybe on this part I can add uh, the reference. So for the reference, I will click here and it will automatically appear because it's already been uh, cited on uh, this particular position. It's a very simple process to do. So those are the steps that you do either to add to edit citation or how to add and edit biography. Okay, now the next step is uh, maybe how did I come up with the, these links? The book, as you can see, where is my? This is my library. As you can see, this list of books. How did I uh, arrive to that particular point? So, what you are supposed to do, if you want, maybe to to get to get the reference. So, what you need to do, go to the Google Scholar, then you search the specific for specific uh, writer that you want to use. For example, if you look at uh, there is a list, for example, to Ruby and Kids, if uh, this is your the keyword, 
then these are the pop-up for example let me use the one to, to extract the reference from uh, the google scholar so you will uh, directly you press maybe you can press there then on uh, the page that will open see whether there is that button or this one so it seems that uh, the button is missing here okay let me go what about this one for this one we have uh, after clicking so you go down and uh, see whether okay you download citation so you can download the citation from this point so you download so the citation will uh, definitely be added will be definitely be added on uh, on your on your Zotero so it's very important that you must have uh, you must ensure that you download the two versions of Zotero, one of them, uh, the one that uh, which will act as a, the extension on your Google, so that whenever you download it here, it will be linked to the one that you have in your PC. Okay, as you can see, after downloading the citation and uh, you go to your Zotero, you'll find that uh, it has already been pinned. There. so you can use it uh, from that point which is very easy so those are the steps that you take in order if you want to add or to add a citation or to add a biography and also to download the whole thing so thank you for taking time to watch my video if you need any clarification just write down uh, the question on the comment section I will get back to you as soon as I get to see your video. Thank you and uh, bye bye. Don't forget to subscribe.